got my fork ready for our next fantastic winner from SIFT. All right, Dustin Hostetler, right? Okay, so your product is, I'm going to show it to the folks right away. You won for this product right here. Tell us about it. Uh, that is uh, Grumpy's Deli's poppy seed dressing. It's the key ingredient in our uh, number one selling item, the garbage salad. And your restaurant is Grumpy's, and that is... Tell us where that is. Yeah, uh, Grumpy's is in the warehouse district uh, in between the Erie Street Market and the ballpark um, mm -hmm. on here on in Lafayette. I was going to say, I did this before, oh, yeah. but just because everyone, that is spectacular. Thank you very much. Candlebar mustache, always welcome on full plate. All right, so you've got a fantastic dressing. You can't tell us the secret. You went, though, from restaurants. People liked it at the restaurant. You knew this would be a hit if yeah. you put it on the market. Yeah, absolutely. We, um, for years, just sold it out of styrofoam containers. Mm -hmm. and. Uh, when we took over the restaurant a year and a half ago, we started bottling it in mason jars, and through the past year and a half, we've slowly evolved the packaging and uh, done a little bit of testing, and uh, we're pretty happy with where it's at right now. And it's fantastic. So start putting together the garbage salad okay, for us. Okay, sure. So we uh, start with mixed greens, mm -hmm. and there's tomatoes. What do people always say about this dressing? Um, there's just something they can't put their finger on. It's just right. perfect, uh, you know, perfect mix of salty and sweet, um, very subtle flavor. We've got chicken, putting some feta cheese in here. It's a little bit of everything in this salad. Um, raisins. Adding a raisin to a salad is genius. It works really well. It, it does. Um, it's the salty and sweet thing again. It's just right. a great combo. Um, getting your product placement there. Onions and mushrooms. Um, there's bacon, that's important. Bacon is important. <laughs> there's uh, two different, I think there's provolone and, uh, this is provolone, yeah. And then I also have croutons and then the key ingredient is the poppy seed dressing and don't shy away from it you go you just all out on it yep and then it's just a matter of we'll do a quick toss and then we're gonna put some uh, parmesan on the top mm -hmm. just a little bit of parm okay and boy is this a messy salad messy messy Wowzers. we love messy so here just that and then a little bit of parm on top beautiful and there you go dig in love it okay you know what else you forgot? Did you say mushrooms? Oh, there's yeah, there's mushrooms okay. in there. It's sweet. I like it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. My favorite. There we go. All right, so we're gonna slide this out. You can get this at Grumpy's and you can get it at Churchill's, right? Or gonna be Churchill's? Soon to be Churchill's, yeah. All right. Now, guys, I want to meet. You want to meet the third final winner here. We've got Nacho Danny. Wait, wait for it. Wait for it. Come on in, Nacho Danny. <laughs> All right, Nacho Danny. Howdy. Howdy. <laughs> All right, so D Dan Ivy is your Dan name. Dan Ivy. But Nacho J Danny is your who you really are. Correct. <laughs> Correct. Okay, tell us about your product, Nacho Danny. Okay, I started all some of this stuff out I, uh, I started almost, uh, I guess, ten years ago, uh -huh. and uh, little did I know that my product would get where it is right now. Three okay. years ago, I battled cancer and got over it a year ago. In the meantime, applied for each and every grant I could get my hands on through the mayor's office. And through uh, Bill, the Chamber of Commerce. For your product? Yes. Okay. So, so what, I did this all it? myself while I, I've got the, this sauce right here that is the uh, sissy sauce, the original, kind of hot and screaming hot. Okay. So let's talk about this. What is this sissy sauce? Well, it's for people that sit behind desks that don't really want heat. <laughs> well, I sit behind desks, but I will eat. But I think I am the sissy sauce. I mean, I think that I'm probably best for, it's the least hot, right? Right. And then, what's this? This is the uh, sissy sauce. This is the, okay, because I, if I eat the hot sauce, I, you know, I don't know. And what's so different about our bottles is we're teaming up with the U.S. Marshal Service out of Washington, D.C. Public Fair will be the only bottle out there that has... The most wanted. Most Here, I'll wanted. take that. Okay, so your sauces go on what tell me about how the best way to use your uh sauce and let me just show them the most wanted this is an innovative idea you're gonna just like how you'd have a milk label for a missing child you've got it you're like the sheriff right correct you'd be sitting in a restaurant you know and you have one of my hot sauce bottles and next thing you know you've got a guy in the kitchen that looks just like the guy that's on the bottle <laughs> And you need to you need to safely call 911 and apprehend that person. U.S. Marshal, yes. Okay. All right, so you've got the sissy sauce, and how are we using the sissy sauce on there? Uh, it's, I use it as kind of like a, a dressing okay. uh, on the side. And, you know, what's so even, even better is you could put it on fish tacos. Right. And uh, steak. I use it on anything that I can get my hands on. I'm a state jalapeno champion out of Texas. 
Okay. So, so I love heat. You love heat. So yes. let's. You've got the sissy sauce, and then what's this one I got here? That's that's one everybody loves. It's called the original, mm, and uh, you can pretty much. Uh, uh, it, all my products have cilantro in it. Mm -hmm. So that's, talk about this. Like when did you go from? I think I make a sauce for our family that we like to this. I had a bottle it and sell it. What what was the process for you? Uh, when my wife kicked me out of the kitchen, when I uh, was in the kitchen at, in the middle of the night cooking all this stuff, and they woke up coughing. They woke up coughing? Coughing because of all the gas. So I ended up having to go <laughs> and find a place to cook. <laughs> so you nearly killed your entire family and thought, this is an idea. <laughs> You know, that's just the steps that I went through. But right. uh, after I, you know, got started, I, I ended up, I had a, um, built a motor home. Everybody knows as Nacho Daddy. I ran down the road that it had uh, seven and a half foot horns on it, four mm -hmm. foot cowboy hat. And uh, I gave out uh, free hot sauce with anything that you bought. Wow. And you don't have this ride anymore, huh? Yeah, I've still got did, it. You, did you, we are the in the process of getting it re revamished with uh, B and B trailer repair. Lovely, lovely. Okay, so where can we get? You already had a business before you run the set, before you went to this contest. That's right. Yes. So what do you hope to happen with the Nacho Danny's sauce I'm, here? Uh, you know, we we've got uh, we've already uh, teamed up with a whole bunch of outfits in Toledo. Uh, the Mud Hens, the Wild Eye, the Casino, the, the Zoo we're working with, and then uh, we got 120 stores. We uh, went with uh, Church Hills, the Andersons, you know, everybody opened arm. They, they uh, greeted me in. My goal is to get uh, three months behind me and then go to Shark Tank. Really? Shark yes. Tank? Ooh, they're kind of mean there. Oh, I'm, All right, I'm well, ready. Okay, so that's your business plan, Shark Tank. And then this is if you want to do the gift set. This is yes. the whole deal. That's correct. Okay, so right now, though, you're just getting your website together, too. That's another thing that Center for Innovative Food Technology kind of helps you guys with a little bit is getting that branding. Yes, you know, and branding. what really helped me was through these grants. I got uh, Bill Worstel at the Chamber of Commerce. They walked me through the grants, uh, uh, BBR and all Capability. So, all right. So, and are you really from Texas? Or are you just I'm a West on? Texas boy. You're West, okay. Yes, and uh, grew up there all my life. My wife decided she wanted to get to come back Closer she to, uh, hog tied you and brought yes, you to Toledo. Hog tied me it's and, a classic uh, romance. You know, I I love Toledo, and we got on our product. Mm -hmm. We trademarked Holy uh, Toledo, W H O L L Y. That's my. There you go. That's my charity, and then Totally Toledo is okay. mine too. Perfect. All right. Thank you so much, Nacho Danny. Thank kinda you. Kind of hot sauce. We kind of healthy. It kind of fits perfect. When we come back, we're gonna make some fish tacos with a winner uh, from last year from Sep. She's doing great. Stay with us. Awesome.